Did you know that the power of will is essential to speaking your truth and achieving your goals? However, is it willingness or willfulness that you want? Stay tuned to find out. Welcome to this episode of Your Personal Wordsmith, tips to communicate with clarity and impact with public speaking and communications expert, Lillian Zarzar. Significant research has been conducted with respect to the mind as the controller of the body and its functions. The power of the mind can be harnessed to achieve goals and enhance personal growth. Furthermore, the power of will is essential in materializing those goals. What does will mean? According to Webster, as a noun, the word will means the power of making a reasoned choice or of controlling one's own actions. Studies indicate most recently that to achieve goals, the difference in willpower is determined by either willingness or willfulness to participate towards setting up a goal. Results have shown that personal objectives are most likely met by willingness. Why is that, you ask? Willingness means that you are favorably disposed or consenting to act on something. Willfulness means that your action is said or done deliberately. You may be stubborn or obstinate. For example, making the statement, I will, in asserting intention, is more likely to undermine a goal than to achieve it, because using will as a verb means it is yet to come about that it is in the future, and the future is always tomorrow. You may also state, I will, in the sense that you will something to happen. Well, this implies that whatever you want happens because you want it to, as opposed to acting on it yourself. On the other hand, will I lends to the notion of autonomy and freedom of choice and possibilities, which are more empowering. Asking yourself, will I be the best person I can be today? Will I make a difference in someone's life today? Will I act on my values instead of reacting to everyone else? That implies you are answering the questions that empower you to make those decisions. Therefore, your willingness to participate in a goal is paramount to achievement versus your willfulness to attain it. Furthermore, in taking control of your life, you are asking yourself the degree of commitment toward that goal. What strategies are you going to ask yourself to be willing to implement in your responsibility toward achieving your goals? A statement in a well-known book indicates this. Ask, and it shall be given. Perhaps you could do more asking rather than stating. Ask yourself, will I call Lillian and make an appointment to create those questions and define those answers? Call me, will you? 614-486-5523. We'll talk then. Thank you for watching your personal wordsmith. For more great information, visit LillianZarzar.com. Also browse the other shows found right here at Columbus Biz TV Shows.